If you're using Instagram to promote your business, you need to make sure that you're posting high quality content. Even if you have no design experience at all, you can use customizable templates to create professional looking Instagram posts. Hey YouTube, it's Lucas here from Snappa, and today I'm gonna show you how easy it is to design an Instagram post for your business. Let's get started. The first step is to go to snappa.com and create a free account. Snappa has all the correct image dimensions built right in, so you can click on the Instagram post size to view our templates. Feel free to scroll through and search for a design that you like. All of our templates are fully customizable, so even if you can't find a design theme that matches your business, you'll be able to personalize it to your liking. I'm going to scroll up and click on this template to start designing. Now that our canvas is open, we can start by editing the text. First, I'm going to select this text box and delete it, and then I'm going to double click this text box and type in the title of my business. Let's say I run an online clothing marketplace called GearSwap. I can type that in and use the toolbar on the left to customize it further. This drop down menu will let me select a new font. I'll choose Cooper Hewitt Heavy and then I can also use these arrows to adjust the size of my text. Next, I'm going to use this slider to increase the line height so that we have a little bit more space between gear and swap. Now, I can use the same tools to quickly edit the other text boxes, and I also want to use the same font family so that everything looks cohesive. If you need to reposition your text boxes, you can simply click and drag them around your canvas. Next up, I want to replace the photo, so I'm going to click on this photo and delete it, and then I can click on the graphics tab to add a new one. I have the option to upload my own photo, or I can click on the photos tab to search through Snappa's built-in stock image library. I'm going to type streetwear fashion in the search bar to see what we can find. There's literally millions of stock photos here that we can use for free so take as much time as you need when sorting through the library. This photo should be perfect, so I'm going to click on it to add it to my canvas, and then I can drag the corners to resize it, and I'll also reposition it to the left. Now that we have our photo set, I'm going to click the Move Layer Back button so that the photo rests behind the paper clip, and I'll quickly reposition the text boxes so that they align with our photo. Now we can play around with the colors. I'm going to click on this shape and pick a different color using the toolbar on the left. I think this dark beige gray color looks great behind the photo, and I can also click on the backgrounds tab to change the background color as well. Lastly, I'm going to click on the paper clip and change its color to white so that it matches the text. This paper clip is from our icons library in the graphics tab so feel free to check it out if you want to use a different icon. Now that we're all finished designing, I can rename my graphic by clicking the pen icon at the top. Then, I'm going to save to avoid losing any progress, and I'll download it as a Retina JPEG for the highest quality and best results. Now, we can upload our graphic right to Instagram, and as you can see, it only takes a few minutes to design a professional looking post for your business. Well, that's all for today's video. If you learned something new, remember to like and subscribe, and we'll see you next time.